Hey Libra, welcome to my channel. This is Chelsea. Thank you so much for liking and subscribing. I really appreciate your love and support. Hope all is well with everyone. And Libra, please bear in mind that this reading will not resonate with each and every one of you. Today, we are going to find out how does your person currently feel about you. Spirits and angels, please show me. How does Libra's person currently feel about Libra? Libra, please bear in mind that roles can be switched in this reading. Could either be how your person feel about you or how you feel about them instead, okay? So they are heartbroken, three of swords here. Looks like they're going to communicate with eight of wands. They still have a lot of feelings towards you, passionate feelings towards you. Hmm, definitely wanting to, uh, to communicate with you. They feel like you could be focusing on your work right now, eight of pentacles, all that. They want to... Uh, work on this connection okay could mean that queen of cups is here could be dealing with a pisces cancer scorpio that means they still have feelings for you they still do love you doesn't matter king or queen it's not gender specific the high priestess is here perhaps both of you are not speaking to each other right now keeping really quiet and we've got the king of pentacles in reverse could be dealing with a virgo capcom taurus somebody here may have either cheated or lied because there's a disloyal king here, okay? But also could mean having, uh, just being unstable in some way, shape, or form, okay? Unstable or unreliable. So we've got the Ace of Wands here in reverse. Mm. They feel like either you could have rejected their offer of a new beginning or a passionate new beginning. And also we've got the Eight of Swords in reverse. Mm. They feel like they really want to stop thinking about you. They could be distracting themselves by working, focusing on work to forget about you, okay, to not think about you. But this could also mean that Libra, they feel like maybe you are releasing them already, like you're walking away, okay. So we've got the magician here. This indicates, yeah, you could be dealing with a Virgo, Gemini. But it looks like they may want to manifest something. They may feel like you think that they are still wearing a false mask or being very deceptive because there's a six of pentacles here in reverse perhaps somebody here was feeding another person if it's not that it just looks like six of pentacles in reverse indicates somebody um not treating the other person fairly okay could also mean like one person is more invested than the other but it does look like they want to restore the balance so because the magician is like for wanting to make something happen because you know, it is now kind of off balance. And we've also got the Eight of Wands here in the first. Two of Wands. Hmm. It does look like they feel kind of indecisive right now with the Two of Wands. They are keeping tabs on you for sure. They're thinking about the future with you, but also trying to make a decision here. But at the same time, they feel like you may have given up on them already. Maybe they, maybe they, Maybe they have uh, hurt you, broken your heart here, but indecisive in regards to re uh, reconciliation or communication, okay? Let's see more. Death is right here, Libra. So they feel like maybe you think this is over. Mm. They feel like maybe you're done with them and that you've already cut them off. Queen of Swords here. Like you're done and you have changed your direction when it comes to love. And that you're doing better without them, okay? So the Queen of Swords is actually your energy, right? The Queen of Swords is very stern, have their guards up. Maybe they feel you've got your guards up or that you're very uh, determined to say no to them. Cut them off, basically, right? You may have your guards up again or demanding something or it could be giving them some sort of some sort of ultimatum they feel like they still love you for some of you you both of you could actually be a same gender uh in a same gender relationship some of you okay um we've got the five pentacles here in my verse this indicates also i feel like they do miss you and that they want to return and we've also got ace of cups here they feel like they want this new beginning with you and they do love you or have very deep emotions for you 
But this could also mean that they feel like you're practicing self-love and self-care currently, okay? Yeah, they're thinking about whether to throw in the towel or to actually fight for this connection. I would say that they do love you, Knight of Cups here, right? They could also feel like maybe you started a new love connection with somebody else, okay? For some of you. Because there's another person here, right? If not, this is just how they feel about you currently. That I, I think it's genuine. I would say that they do love you. But whatever happened in the past here, you know, could have been anything. But the feelings are still there. Six of Cups is in reverse, Libra. So they feel like maybe you have uh, bad memories in regards to them. Maybe they think that you don't, you will never want to return to them, okay? Three of Wands is here. They could be waiting for the right moment, thinking about the future. Perhaps there could be still a chance for both of you to get back together with a Wheel of Fortune. Wheel of Fortune could also indicate second chance. Maybe they want a second chance from you, but waiting for the right moment to ask you for it. We also got the Hermit in the first. They definitely have gone into soul searching, reflecting over what had happened. And now they're realizing their fault. They could also feel like you've already come out from your hermit mode and that you're you're meeting other people or dating other people or you know start a new relationship if you are okay let's see more mm. they definitely feel like you're taking charge of your life right now you're very attractive to them but they also feel that maybe you you are done with them again. They're always in reverse, so they may feel like you've cut them off because um, you feel that they are negative or toxic in some way, shape, or form. Some of you maybe they did put you in a third party situation and you remove yourself from the equation. Okay, so we got the King of Swords here. There are a lot of people here, Libra. <laughs> may not always mean a lot of people. It just could just be the energy all right so uh, king of swords here they feel like you're very again very straight very determined because we have we did have another queen of swords look yeah so there's a pair right right here queen of swords and the king of swords so they may feel that both of you either not talking to each other or both of you like are standing your ground and believing that it, you are right, <laughs> okay, whether they think you, you think you're right or that they think they're right, okay. So both of you may not see eye to eye on certain things. Mm. Someone is definitely upset if there is a third party here with the Queen of Wands, wanting to know if this person is still with the third party, could be the spying as well. All right, Libra, this is your reading. I hope you resonated. If you did, please hit like, share, and subscribe. I'm going to leave you with four videos on the screen right now. Uh, these are the videos from my second vlog channel if you're interested to check it out. Um, there's also some tarot reading over there. Um, but in any case, Libra, I hope to see you tomorrow at your next reading. Take care.